Hey guys, I have a quick story for you. Um, Aaron's dad has given me free hockey tickets for tonight. So they're free tickets to the Flyers game against the Washington Capitals. So just to be, you know, a pain and be a little aggressive, I decided to wear my Buffalo Sabres shirt. They're not playing tonight, but I got to represent my hometown. And I also have a Buffalo Bills flag on my car. Anyways, I invited two guys from the church, um, this one guy named Brian, who's probably in his late 30s, and this one kid named Taylor, who's 14. He's in my youth group. So we decide, okay, we're going to go. We're going to go to this hockey game. Um, so we, we drive into Philly, and we're waiting in line. Um, we're in our cars. We're trying to drive into the parking lot. We're waiting in line to pay for parking. Um, and some guy like is looking over at me, and he's like, yeah. So I'm like, wants me to roll my window down. So I say, okay. He rolls, I roll the window down, and he's like, we're from Buffalo. You got the Bills? Like, you, you like the Bills? I'm like, yeah. He's like, yeah, go Bills. Go Buffalo, yeah. This guy's, this guy's in the passenger seat, and he's obviously drunk out of his mind. He doesn't know what's going on. So I was like, yeah, go Buffalo, undefeated, all right. I was trying to humor him and whatever. So we get through. So I'm like, okay, so we, we pass each other, all right. I get through the line, and you... You go through the line, and then you have to turn into the lot. So he goes through the turn. In the middle of the turn, middle of the turn, he convinces his buddy who's driving to stop the car. And he runs over to me in my car. And he's like, hey, hey, take this. This is from Buffalo. And I look into his hand. I'm like, what's he giving me? And he hands me this. He hands me a beer. Labatt Blue. It's not from Buffalo. It's from Canada. But Labatt's... Uh, um, United States headquarters are in Buffalo, but anyways, so he's like, "I'll oh, take this. It's from Buffalo." I'm like, "Oh, great!" So here I am with two people from my church. You know, I'm a pastor, and this guy's busting out of his car to hand me a beer. So I hand it. I go to the guy next to me. I'm like, "Here, you, you take it." And the, and the thing is about the guy next to me is he's a recovering alcoholic, and he's like, "I'm not touching it." He wouldn't even like hold it. He's like, "No, I'm not touching it." I'm like, "Oh, okay." And so I motion to the back seat, here, you t oh, and then I'm remembering, oh, the kid behind me is 14 years old. <laughs> he really shouldn't have it either. And I was like, oh, oh, so we have a pastor who can't drink. We have a recovering alcoholic and a 14-year-old in this car with a beer. And I'm like, oh, oh, I'm just going to stick it under my seat. So it was just a very funny exchange. And so I can't believe this guy got out of his car in the middle of a turn. Like He stopped mid-turn to get out of his car. And, and give me a beer. That's just the hospitality you will only find in Buffalo, ladies and gentlemen. Only find from a Buffalonian. So, yeah, that's my story. Thanks, guys. Bye.